Hello and welcome back to the Ms. Artastic YouTube channel. In today's episode, we're going to be drawing something. Now, not just anything, we're actually going to be drawing a lovely <laughs> licking lizard. Yeah, it's a licking. Ew. Like what? Or maybe, maybe it's delicious. Yeah. Let's think about it that way. Something delicious. I don't know. You can use your imagination on that one. Because that is what it is. That's what, well, what I'm trying to say is that's what making art is all about. Just use your imagination and see what happens. So grab something to draw with and something to color with. And let's make a licking lizard artwork. <laughs> This episode is brought to you by ArtasticKids.com. If you're a parent, guardian, homeschool family, or a classroom teacher looking for art lessons and resources, begin your journey by finding free art lessons, tips, advice, and more at ArtasticKids.com. All right, we are going to be doing a licking lizard. So grab something to draw with and something to color with. And here we go. We're gonna start off with, whoa, that's gray. We're gonna start off with black, or whatever you're drawing with. I'm using marker and I'm using black. Big black line, curve it down and up. And I'm gonna curve out on the angle or a diagonal on the top, on both sides. Bring it down and connect to the bottom. Then I'm gonna go Start up about two finger spaces up on that part. And then I'm gonna go curve it in and end it with a letter M. Two curving lines up from either side of that. And then bring it down and up and connect. So now I got a mouth. On the tongue, bring a line down the center of each part. And of course we need to add taste buds, so add some bumps to wherever you want to add some taste buds to make it extra weird. We don't do normal around here. Gotta be a little bit different to stand out. Okay. Let's add the snout. Add some nostrils, some corners in the mouth here, and a bottom jaw. One circle on one side, one circle on the other. In each circle, we're going to draw a lizard eye pupil, so two curving lines down, with a circle in the center. Color in the dark of the eyes, leaving those little white, little circles in the center, nice and white. Okay, above the head, we're gonna have a line go up, down, and around each eye, out, and back and towards the tongue, out towards the tongue. We're gonna have arms come out on either side. So one coming out this way with a little elbow. And one just hiding in the back. And then we'll bring this one in the front out like this. With three big pointed toes. And then we're gonna do some foreshortening so we're not gonna see most of the body. We're gonna draw one, two, Taper lines, and then we're gonna see just two legs coming out in the back with some three long toes because they generally have longer toes in the back. And then we're gonna bring it out towards the tail, and it's all gonna look very small going out towards the back there. So it looks like this is really close and that's far away. Where those back legs are, we're gonna add just a little letter C shape. 
and then we'll do a line up the center for some stripes. And you can add some spots if you want. Of course, things get smaller as farther away they are. You can add spots on the arms if you would like, or even on the head. And once you're done drawing your licking lizard, yeah, you can go ahead and grab your favorite colors and go ahead and color it in, color it in. You must go ahead and color it in. Yeah, you're welcome. I know you wanted to hear that today. And once you're done coloring in your lizard, your licking lizard, your licking lizard is done.